we have um, that camel lights, please. No, actually, I was here first, right? Yeah. Okay. Fucking well, fucking A, you wait. Fuck. LM Green Pack 100 in a box. And now I'm not done. Okay. Asshole. All the time you need. I will. No, no, no. I don't give a damn. Next time, you act like you lost some sense when you're talking to me. I don't, really I don't give a damn you trying to talk over me. Yeah, because you didn't even know what you wanted. That's what? That's what you needed. There's a nice ass fucking parking lot. Get in there. Parking lot. I'll get in the parking lot. Okay, thank you. Please. And I need that. Yeah. Spending money is good for yeah. I'm taking pleasure in this. Yeah. Buy a bunch yeah. of muffins. You'll show me. Mm -hmm. Buy like what? 70 muffins. I what? Want You're the asshole that's still back there. Buy more muffins. You're the asshole that's still back there. More muffins. No, I don't want it. Well, I'm not. Yeah. Buy more of a muffin. Seven muffins enough. Pop up pop me. That's right. What? I can do this all day. That's fine. All, all the time. Day. More muffins. That's There's only like 15 more muffins there. I can wait. There's only like 15 ass muffins and you don't get the fuck out of my face. You're exactly not right now. Did that just happen? Say something else. Say something else. And watch me beat your ass. <laughs> oh, come on. Have a little Say something else. <laughs> Say something else. I'm going to race to the car with my man. Say something else. Yeah, I got that. Say something else. Yes, please. Do Say something. something else. Tell your stupid ass. Now what's popping? Now, did I tell you no man? Don't fuck with me. Now, I did not give enough nothing. After that. One of the things that I believe is one of the most, um, I would say, hindering things that, that seems to be repetitive for us blacks particularly. When we're dealing with any type of social matter, whether it be us dealing with us or us dealing with other races, but us specifically dealing with white people and police officers, white police officers to be specific. We have already uh, something feeding the way we feel about the situation. You know, we have already, you know, our beliefs, our our feelings, our scars, our wounds, our experiences, whatever it is, it's some things that fuel the way we see things, the way we, you know, when, when I'm dealing with a certain person or a certain type or a certain situation, it's things that, 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 it's things in my belief system, things that come in, in regards to my experiences that fuel the way that I uh, 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 kind of like experience or see or feel about my perspective about this whole experience, my perspective about this person, my, my perspective about police, my perspective about black, my perspective about dudes in the hood, people in the hood, my perspective about uh, females that wear we, you know, all that my, my experience fuels my perspective fuels the way I feel, fuels how fast either a person can make me feel good or how fast I become upset with a person. I have personal experiences that are associated to this. So now, being aware of that, that's one lesson. You have to be aware of what that is. Because, again, go to the video, get to know thyself. 
learn, study that, accept that challenge. But now, again, uh, <clears throat> understanding that, becoming aware of that with yourself. <clears throat> As you see in this video, first, what she could have done. First of all, the, the, the head to say racist video, right? Like racist white man get basically get sprayed by the woman. I didn't see racism. I seen a white man and a black woman. I seen a man that was a bit rude, you know, because he didn't say excuse me, just that another. He just kind of, I guess, got tired of waiting on her, and so he was finna go ahead and try to do what he gonna do so he can leave, I guess. So he was rude. He was impatient. But I didn't hear anything in regards to race being brought out of it. And we have to make sure we stop doing that. Naming something race-based when it's not. Okay. So it, 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 that's wrong. That's one of the pieces, right? The other piece is that what I seen was that he was mainly only taunting her. He was laughing. He began to entertain her. But her, what could she have done differently? She also entertained him. She also like welcomed the game. You know, you have you have you have to you have to become a part of the game for the game to take place. You have to say I'm a play before the game can uh, persist in any situation, in any matter really almost. You know, when you're dealing with the devil, you have to you have to you have to engage the devil for the devil to even be able to uh, exercise his wrath on you a lot of times. You have to engage, you have to open the door for it. You know what I'm saying? So now what she and when I say devil I mean anybody. I'm saying whether it be figuratively or whether it be the devil in human form. So now she began to she began to speak too way way too much. She didn't have to say all the stuff she said. She didn't have to entertain. She didn't have to turn around and give her no energy, no attention. But she chose to. Once you choose to do something, it's things that come with it. And so whatever comes with your choice is something that you become accountable for and responsible for. So she told she turned around, made a choice, decided she's going to entertain. She started saying what she said, how she felt, the way she going to see it, what she going to do, what she ain't going to do, this, that, and other, right? Now, mind you, the guy only did what? Laugh, taunt, start kind of like saying little stuff about what she got in the bag. He ain't said nothing about her directly. He ain't said nothing about the way she look. You stupid. He ain't said none of that to her. All he started kind of like just taunting her about that kind of little stuff. And she just get out, out, out of, she just going crazy. And he might have found that to be entertaining. You know what I'm saying? Because that's Unfortunately, a characteristic black people have, black women have, is to get, you know, hyped up and belligerent real quick sometimes. So now, he pulls back, started laughing. You see, he pulled back, get him some distance. He still started laughing. And he even said, uh, have a sense of humor. He said, have a sense of humor, right? He said, have a sense of humor. And, and, and now, whether he was trying to be condescending or not, the thing is that, she, she, the, the decision that I see she could have made is that she should have been stopped entertaining him. She should have been stopped engaging him, especially if she felt like he was being condescending or she felt like he was being rude or she felt like he was being racist or whatever the case may be. Now, uh, when she turned around and sprayed him, when she turned around and sprayed him, she was unjustified. That was assault and had he responded, he would have defended himself. And then everybody been all over the media as though the white man or male, period, attacked the black woman. But she was out of line. Period. Point blank. She was out of line. She, if she didn't go to jail against the charges out on her, it was only because that dude, for whatever reason, didn't press charges. And didn't push the issue. Because she assaulted this man with that mace. Now, in her thinking, she, she might feel like she was justified. And that's the other point, the final piece I really want to add to this here. Man, check your feelings. Because if you go through life dealing with people by the way you feel, your feelings will make you think you are justified in what you see, what you hear, and what you do. Your feelings will have you thinking you're justified. Get outside your feelings and start thinking, using it and activating it and, and, and moving through life with your mental. Think, think, think with your mental. Because it is only when you really begin to lay down certain particulars, you know, the facts, I'm what to say, the truths or whatever, right, is the only way you can really justifiably make a decision, you know, on, on, on how you're going to deal with something, how you're going to deal with a person, how you're going to deal with a situation. When you're trying to feel your way through everything, you're going to constantly find yourself in situations where you, 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 you're going to feel like a victim, or, or, or you're going to flesh somebody down you wrong, or you're going to uh, uh, regret it, one of the, one of the three. You know, so with all that being said, y'all just let me know what y'all think. Y'all feel like I'm wrong. Y'all feel like I'm right. Just chime in. Let me know what you think. Remember, man, go to my, 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 my channel. If you're not watching.
Watching this on YouTube right now, go to YouTube and subscribe. If you're on IG, uh, follow. If you're on Facebook, follow. You know, just you know, get along with the support, share.